Ready to avoid expensive mistakes in your expense game? Today we're your guide for mastering Zoho expense. Join us as we dive into customizing workflow rules, handling approval workflows, and automating your expenses for a smoother financial journey. Workflow rules allow you to trigger various actions such as email, SMS, in-app notification, or custom function whenever the transactions satisfy the conditions you've configured. To set up a workflow rule, navigate to Settings under Admin View and select Workflow Rules under Automation. Click Add New Workflow Rule. Specify rule name. Select a module for which you need to trigger the workflow. There are three options – Reports, Advances and Advanced Refunds. Click Next to specify workflow type – Event-based or Date-based. For Event-based workflow rule, select when you want the rule to be triggered in the drop-down below. When report is submitted, approved or may be rejected. For a date-based type, specify date of execution, time, and frequency at which the workflow should be triggered. You can skip filters part and jump to actions straight away or add more conditions on which the rule will be executed. You can set up to 10 conditions for a workflow. Select the field for which the condition should be satisfied. and specify the value. For multiple conditions, define if they should be satisfied both by selecting AND, or at least one of them by selecting OR. To remove the condition, click on the minus icon. The next step is to associate action with the workflow which may be an immediate action or a time-based action if you check the box below. Select the action type, then either select the action from the list or create a new one. Save. If you're eager to avoid costly mistakes and want more useful insights, remember to give us a thumbs up and subscribe. If you have questions or suggestions, share them with us at knowhowatcustomerization.ca.